Welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes. Fire Emblem. With our shady captain. With our fucking... I'm gonna go through the tightest area I possibly <laughs> can find. There's like open water everywhere. But... But these reefs are fucking mocking me, and I'm gonna defeat them <laughs> by driving right through them. Ike, there's some th- one here we are complaining, or com- <laughs> complaining, c- complaining, com- claiming. I've been at sea for years. I fucking don't know how to speak. Complain, or c- <laughs> God, I keep doing that. <laughs> claiming to be an envoy from the theocracy of Benyon. She's been asking if the princess of Crimea is aboard. What do you want to do? Kill her. A Benyon envoy? How did you know about the ship? Hmm. Perhaps she had word from King Galia. On the other hand, this is Benyon we're speaking of. I imagine it has spies every corner of the continent. Perhaps one of those spies is the source of her information. So you shouldn't be surprised that she knew about Princess Alencia, right? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> but it's extremely unusual, ben- no, uh, Benyon, to send an envoy to meet princess whom they do not even acknowledge. What do you mean? It's a complicated matter. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> you see, the envoy is essentially an extension of the Empress herself. Both Crimea and Dan were once part of Benyon. Both nations have only recently splintered from the theocracy. Earth. Yeah, theocracy. Yeah, theocracy. I can't fathom why the Empress would extend the courtesy of an envoy to a nation she must consider somewhat beneath her. She must be planning something. Always oh, the skeptical. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously. Beneath her? That's is somewhat harsh, don't you think? It's Soren. Harsh, perhaps, but it's true. Clothing, uh, clothing it in sweet words will not hide its bitterness, will it? Soren, even I would question the tactfulness <laughs> of your words. <laughs> fucking, tr- God. I will try to be more diplomatic. God, fuck. Fucking, just complain, complain, complain everywhere I go. <laughs> just walks away, hands up in the air. <laughs> Ike, Nasir, you have no need to scold Soren. His words are just that. They do me no harm. I didn't even know you were here. Really <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad to hear that, Princess. But he should bear his man or mind his manners and fucking side eyes him. He's like, fucking, I got it. Jesus Christ. Fuck. This I how we ought to treat, uh, treat with this out of my more pressing issue. Princess, will you be here and hear her message? I believe I must. We gain nothing by refusing to see her. Let us meet with this envoy. To the deck. And get <laughs> shot in the face. Oh, yeah. Oh, you. she's pretty. Yeah, I like her. Um. Uh. Yeah, I'd fucking <laughs> be you or be me. <laughs> I might as well. You've got more characters, I think. Okay. Um. Princess Alencia of Crimea, I presume. Yes. It is an honor to meet you. My name is. Tanith? Tanith. <laughs> <laughs> I am Deputy Commanding Officer of Benyon's Holy Guard. Or Tanith, but I think Tanith. I think Tanith, too. Yeah. We're Americans. Yep. I must ask, what would Benyon want of me that she would send her holy guard to greet me? The Apostle has learned of you, Princess Alencia, and she has come here to meet with you personally. The duty falls upon me to take you to her now. The Apostle? I am to meet... Surely the Apostle has better things to do, then. Nope, she's pretty bored. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> Will you accompany me? I suppose that I... We're the princess's escort, and we will become with her. I hope you understand. Of course. Then yes, I will go with you. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> uh, Bad news, ma'am. We decided that like it was in the apostle's position. Birdman! Crows, most likely. Hmm. We have seen their kind before. They fancy themselves pirates without a ship, but they're thieves, plain and simple. Commander Sigrun is with the Apostle, and it'll take more than a few winged scavengers to get past her. So do pirates have, like, a standing above thieves? Or are they, like, a little bit more honorable? They're like, oh, they're not thieves, but they're pirates. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <bit> <laughs> Let's remain calm. I actually, I'm afraid why we aren't quite sure where the Apostle is. What? No. Yeah, that's very much. She's like, she's like, are you fucking serious? <laughs> They've kidnapped the apostle? No, no. I, 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 from the commander said what the commander said. The apostle grew impatient and had another one of her uh, uh, more willful moments. 
I asked at the dock, and sure enough, one of the whole longshoremen heard her order the ship to set sail without us. What? Where were her attendants? What was she doing without a guard? Why can't she just never stay put? I've told her time and time again that the seaports here are rampant with pirates and crow thugs. <laughs> thugs. <laughs> right. Where is she now? Thug life. <laughs> <laughs> the wind is poor today, so I think her ship should not be too far from us. I came here as quickly as I could. Understood. We'll move immediately. Excuse me, but is something wrong? Yeah, my fucking apostle. Yeah. Your Highness, I must apologize, but an urgent matter has arisen, and I must attend to it immediately. I will return for you later. Await my return. Wink, <laughs> wonk. <laughs> what was that all about? Did you see the way she was looking at you? <laughs> nudge, nudge. I may not be the only gay person on board. Yeah, uh, <laughs> Judging by her expression, I'd say something has happened to the person she's meant to be protecting. <laughs> Sucks. You know that look, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Say, do you think that ship over there is involved? The envoy is flying in that direction. Is the truck threading the needle? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, the Pegasus Knight's fears have already been realized. They're under attack! There's a Ravis' is back up, isn't it? <laughs> Whoa, Ike! <laughs> Why don't we go lend them a hand? Oh, what, you want to help somebody? This is it actually kind of... That's because fucking Soren sees a fucking opportunity to move up in the world a little bit. Uh, <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> Are you feeling alright, Soren? Not you out for help to anyone. It's a great opportunity <laughs> to put the Empress in our debt. We'd be fools to pass that up, wouldn't we? This is like the great opportunity of me being like, what the fuck, Soren? And you've been exactly like Soren, yeah, so you I know entirely, what he's thinking. I'm entirely <laughs> scumbag the exact same way. Like, I play the neutral card so hard, and Max is like, I'm the good guy. Like, I just can't not be good. I'm like, and like, then his other gut friend is like uh -huh. super bad. And oh, stuff. Really? Like, we'll just like <laughs> fuck over everyone. And then I'm like, I will see, I'll play both sides and make everybody happy, but also get everything from both the sides. Because you played both sides and they all think you're your friends. Because I'm a fucking sleaze <laughs> and a schmoozer. I, I'm generally a nice person, but then I'll do things out of spite. Then I'll just be like, fuck you. I'm doing it anyways. <laughs> Yeah. So you can imagine how angry I was when <laughs> Mass Effect 3 took out the neutral option. And I was like, you yeah, fuckers. That was not fun. I was like, I have to choose a side. <laughs> now I'm going to no. be equally mad and nice at the same time. <laughs> You're going to be nice. You're going to be nice. <laughs> well, you'd have known you'd had an angle. <laughs> ah, he's like finger gunning at Ike. <laughs> well, you know, I need to do you. I don't approve of Soren's motivations, but I agree that we should help. <laughs> He's like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, then that's what we'll do. Will you be alright on your own, princess? You're doing the right thing. I would not dream of stopping you. Besides, I've been trained in swordplay. <laughs> I know those pirates are no match for your strength. Give them... Give them a sound thrashing. Make sure it's sound, though. Not not unsound, but sound. <laughs> huh, you're starting to sound like one of those, aren't you? All right, then we better go! Yeah, I imagine Soren in these kind of opportunities is like fucking that like episode of Arrested Development. It's like, there's a fire sale? <laughs> <laughs> you're like, you're hired. <laughs> there's an opportunity? <laughs> Shit! Oh, hey, remember when yes. we were talking yeah. about fucking two ships and three planks and god fucking damn it. Yeah, I wonder why it was three stars. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, I think that's literally the next battle. When we're talking about well, it, was like, he was saying that, and I was just, I was so close to being like, hmm, yeah, foresight. I wonder. <laughs> I wonder. Ugh. No matter how many defeat, there are more waiting to attack. And not just those ravens of Kilvas, either. There are Bjork, too. What do they all want here? Fucking weird. Need a little help? <laughs> <laughs> How'd you hear him? You! Aren't you Pr Princess Crimea's escort? No, yeah, she's right over there next to fucking <laughs> trying to blend into the wood guy. <laughs> he does kind of, doesn't he? Yeah, no, he's fucking so dark that he's just like, I can hide in any fucking shadow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the princess already has to come to your aid. May we join the fray? Not really, but okay. That would be appreciated. We'll keep the ravens at bay in the interim. Why don't you go ahead and move onto that ship? The big vessel is ours. I'm not so sure who the small one belongs to. Hey, I asked if we could join the freight and see so you could boss us around, boss <laughs> pants. 
There are human soldiers aboard, but if they're in this part of the sea, they must be pirates. Cut them down. Right. We will slice them like cake. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> I want to eat them. What? No. <laughs> <laughs> Sword's like, yes, we're all cannibals. <laughs> uh, cannibal Shia uh, LaBeouf. <laughs> actual cannibal Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> We're at quiet, quiet. Sorry, it got stuck <laughs> in my head. <laughs> Why on earth is the holy guy between the crews and the pirates? We're outnumbered. It's only a matter of time before we're overwhelmed. Oh, yeah, you. Um. I will. Yeah, whatever. Go ahead. I will fight, too. You? You're one of the passengers from the house. Or from House Damio, aren't you? Can't permit some of your stature to throw herself into harm's way. Look here, fuckhead. Do you no. see my fucking horse? <laughs> yeah. I was once a knight at Benyon, albeit only for a short while. I won't get in your way. <laughs> I don't believe we're gonna see it. No, I can't. <laughs> we must defend the apostle, right? We do not have the luxury of choosing how to do so. Is that Gatry? I don't know. The blue guy? Maybe. That was his color. I just got very distracted really quickly because. Astrid's the name of my friend's cat. Oh, yeah. There's the personification of it. <laughs> the fucking human portrait. <laughs> <laughs> when a uh, uh, cataful boyfriend oh, God. starts up. <laughs> Re-releasing on the PS4. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, God. Um, come, we must get ready. The enemy is coming. Nah, <laughs> yeah, you're right. We need every able fighter, except my apology, and thank you for your help. Yeah, you're right, bitch. Yep. You were right. Yay. Lady Astrid, allow me to serve with your shield. <laughs> yeah. Gotcha. <Wow. laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm fucking slap you. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I'm so sorry that I've gotten you involved in this, too. I was waiting for you to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. This is nothing. I'm fine. Well, <laughs> before I was sorry, the bodyguard was top-notch mercenary. You can handle this many opponents all by myself. This is nothing. If only Shinnin was here. If only my boyfriend. <laughs> he had long, flowing red hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just passed over. That's fine. It's still there. Yeah. Is that so? Your confidence is impressive, to say the least. Tee-hee! <laughs> <laughs> well, trust me. <laughs> my confidence is back with my blade. I'm ready to fight. What? <laughs> Oh, fuck, are there more of them? We're doomed! No, no panic, we must protect the possum no matter what! Listen up, Pirates Gum, you may have never. Wait, wait! I'm getting confused, we're here to help you! We're your reinforcements! Can't you tell by the clothes? Yeah, yeah we're, <laughs> we're not shady looking. <laughs> Except for Soren over here. Yeah, that one, you, you go ahead. <laughs> Full fuck him rain. up. Yeah, <laughs> just fuck him up. <laughs> so he's like, just fuck me up. <laughs> The deputy commander of the Holy Guard asked us to help drive the enemy from the ship. The uh, <laughs> <laughs> apostle is taking refuge in the cabin deck below deck. Until the Holy Guard arrives, we need you to defend the entrance of the ship cabins. Got a guy for Yeri. Weapons <laughs> ready. Everyone. Time to have somebody sit on that square. Sit on the square. And we're going to call this episode. It's a little yeah. early. But sucks because I'm than not making... gonna get in a minute of shit. Yeah. yeah, better than making this episode half an hour. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> we'll catch you guys on the flip side of this battle, or maybe during this battle, depending on you know talking to Gatry probably. Yeah, Gatry anyway. side eye. <laughs> anyway, till next time. Bye.